Hello all you coin aficionados out there and welcome to DC Coin World International Coin Channel. Today we have some 20 cent coins, 20 euro cent coins from the Republic Francaise, the French Republic. This is the first map euro coin and these are from 1999, 2000 and 2001. Now this is the first year that France uh, put out the euro coin 1999. You can see this one is in beautiful shape here. It has the uh, updated version of the sewer uh, who was on many of the French coins. The woman sewing grain in the field and you can see kind of the grain sack here and a handful of grain. It almost looks like light emanating from her hand too. You can see the stars from the European um, countries. Uh, so let's count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 stars in the European countries. And you can also see uh, something right here. And if we turn it sideways so you can actually read it, you'll see that it is, uh, right here it says, uh, El Jorio Dap O Roti. So this is the famous roti um, sewer, and uh, it's in an adaptation by El Jorio uh, for this particular coin. And you can see it has way, these very, very, very modern lines. Now, some of you people say, why is it all dented? It, it's not. Those of you who haven't used the Euro 20 cent coin uh, will, will find out now, I guess, that it has these indentations in it all the way around the rim. And that's one of the ways you can identify the 20 uh, euro cent is that it has the indentations. Uh, if we look at the 50 euro cent, we see that that has kind of a deep reading on it. And all the different euro coins have different edges. And so you can stand them up or you actually can feel them with your hands uh, if they're in your pocket and you can tell which euro coin you have. This one here with the indentations is called the Spanish flower. It has seven indentations on it. If we flip this coin over, we see that it is the first map of the Euro uh, coin set. And we, we see that there are seven, six, I'm sorry, six stars here and six at the bottom. So there are 12 total. And these are the 12 countries. Now there was another map put out after the year 2006, the second map came out, but these are all first map coins. So in 1999, there were 454 million of these made, essentially almost half a billion. And the reason that it was, um, that it, so many were made was because it was the first year of the Euro uh, coin in France. So they just made a ton of them. If we look, um, closely at it, we can see that there's a little um, B down here, and then there's a little mark um, from the uh, head of the mint here. So these these are special marks um, to show uh, that they were minted in France, and those are the essentially privy marks of the head of the mint. So there were 454 million of these made, they're worth 20 something cents, which is about what they would be cash value. So if you converted this um, uh, $2, it would be worth 23 cents, which is what it's worth um, then and what it's worth now because these are still marketable coins. It's, it's a, a metal or materials called Nordic gold uh, that they make this out of. It's not real gold, but it does have a gold color. If we look to the year 2000 coins, and this one's a little bit more worn, as you can see, in the year 2000, they made 149 million, still worth the same 23 cents. And then in the year 2001, they made 256 million. So these coins, between the three of them, they made about 850 million uh, plus in the first three years. Now they are, again, they are a Nordic gold coin. They are 5.74 grams. They are 22.25 millimeters in diameter and 2.14 millimeters in thickness. 
And even in uncirculated, these coins are not going to be worth a whole lot to you. It's hard to get up to um, even 50 cents um, unless you get some of the coins uh, from these years that were sold in sets only, and then they would be worth a couple dollars. But there are, I mean, the reason there is a 1999 that was sold in sets only, and that's worth uh, between two and three dollars, but they only made 35,000 of the sets only, and then they only made 15,000 proof coins. So if you find this in a sets only or in a proof coin, you have some value there. Um, but if you find these regular coins, they're still worth um, just common value. Uh, they're still circulating coins, and they're still money in the country of France and the rest of the Euro countries. All right, that's all we have today from the DC Coin World International Coin Channel. We'd love to have you subscribe to our channel and leave any comments you have in the comment section.